Check that out. It's gonna be a little gold ring. Oh, it's a big one too. Check that out. It's got diamonds in it too. Woo! It's a seated. It is a seated quarter. And I just dug my first large scent. Yes, 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 yes. I'm so happy. No, it's a peace dollar. It's a peace dollar. That is a breastplate, eagle breastplate, folks. All right, this is going to be a cool token. Man, check that out. That's just Look at that, guys. I have never dug a U.S. plate. Ah, you got to kiss her. She's beautiful. What is it? Give me a hug. <laughs> He's hugging me. That must be good. Well, Preacher Digger is back on the road after about a two-month hiatus and uh, got a friend with me today. We got Dig and Duck Holiday with us. Headed back over to an old football field that we've hunted many times and other guys have hunted. I've done several uh, videos over there uh, called Gridiron, Gridiron Treasures. But uh, we're going to take the manacores back over there and we're going to see what we can find, practice a little bit better, and listen to the deep stuff. We got all the surface stuff off, now we're listening deeper. And I found that real nice token uh, there as well, that Jefferson uh, Lumber token or Merchant token. I found some dimes, and I know there's more out there. But uh, we've updated the mana cores. We're going to go out here and just kind of grid off, go deep, listen deep and faint, and dig everything and see what we can come up with. So it's good to get back in the saddle, good to get with a buddy, good to get back out here and do some digging. Hopefully we're going to find some good treasures. And when we do, we're going to put the camera on it. We're going to show you guys. And hopefully we'll find something, maybe not a whole lot. And stay tuned to the very end because I'm going to be giving away a finds pouch and a peace dollar. So stay tuned to the end. Maybe you'll be one of the lucky winners to win those prizes as well. So until we get there, I'll see you guys out in the field. Well, we made it out to our location today and this is what we're going to be doing it's an old football field I've done many videos out here but there's always something to be found I found that last video I found that token right out here and so hopefully we're gonna get some get on something maybe something good and uh, we're also going to play a little game, me and Hunter. Uh, we're going to play the Wheaties game. Whoever can find the most Wheaties is going to, I'm going to give a Mercury Dime to the winner. Well, if he beats me, I'll give him a Mercury Dime. If I win, I'll just keep it. But uh, so we're going to kind of keep a running score on who's going to get the most Wheaties out of here as well. And don't forget, got that giveaway at the end, so stay tuned. So let's suit up. Let's get in the field. Let's get swinging. Hunter's going to be swinging his mana core. I'm going to be swinging on my mana core and uh, it's going to be running in the normal setup today. Did do the upgrade on it, update I mean, and uh, see what we can get. Yeah, Hunter got the first target of the day. Look at that. That's a, that's a good one, boy. <laughs> Somebody made 1960s, it. 1960s, 1970s stainless steel. Definitely stainless. Yeah, first find of the of the day. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Let's get something better, better now. Just call 100 over here. I've got my first target. It was ringing up a 9 or a 10. Well, I got a pull tab and a pencil eraser. Didn't know what it was. I'm trying to relearn my, my tones again. It's been since May since I've dug with the, the mana core. And check this out. Check that out. Gonna be a little gold ring. There we go. Well, that is pretty cool. There we go. Uh-oh. Where'd it go? You found it once. You can uh, find it again. Uh-oh. Well, let me clean it up. 
let me clean it up and uh, we'll show it to you. All right, guys. Let's see. It's going to be gold. Definitely. Yeah, it's broken around the bottom. I see a marking in it. Right there. All right. Well, check that out. A little gold ring. First target. Preacher Digger back in the swing and got him a gold ring. All right, let's see if we can find a marking on this. Well, I can't get a, a marking on it yet. But it's real small. It may be gold plated, but it feels gold. It looks gold. But that little dark color there is getting me to think it may be plated but maybe not maybe it's just needs to be cleaned up so i'll clean it up when we get back and uh by the time you watch this video you'll know exactly what it is but hey that's a good fun good deal yeah good deal let's get a picture let's keep on swinging all right it's getting a 73 74 gonna have the first weedy so preacher digger one and wild bill over there hunter he is zero so this is pretty toasted but i'll take it there's the head let's flip it over should be right there it's a weedy though all right let's keep swinging i got a good tone here i'm gonna live dig this one it's jumping up to an 81 Probably gonna be a penny. There's 82. All right. Let's see if we can get a silver out of this. Hopefully. What's it gonna be? There it is. It's gonna be a penny. That's gonna be a penny. And it's gonna be a weedy. I'll take it. That's number two for me. Hunter's got one. I mean, zero. All right, let's keep swinging for that silver. Hunter's calling me down. Says he's got something foreign, maybe Canadian. So let's go check it out. I got two weedies. How many weedies do you have? Two to zero. Let's see what you get. I'm trying to clean up my blood before you got over here with the camera, though. Oh, yeah. Canadian penny. Check that out. 1953? 53. This is wheat years, but we can't count it as a weedy, though, can we? No. Well, that's something new. Something new. There we go. Congratulations, brother. Thank you. Let's pop some silvers. Let's do it. All right. I'm going to dig this live. I got a good high tone here. All in the 80s. About six inches deep. But where I'm at, I've been digging nothing but clad out of here. So we're going to try, just in case, if this is going to be a good silver quarter. Or maybe a dime. I've been digging lots of pencil erasers. Lots of pull tabs. And lots of clad. So hopefully this won't be clad. Yeah, it's going to be. And it's right there. It's going to be a dime. Just a clad dime. That's what I've been digging out of here. One of these is going to have to be silver eventually. All right, let's keep trucking. I'm back out here on the field on the guest side working this fence row and I've got 90-91 about 8 inches deep and you can see it's right on the line great tone 
All right, we're gonna hand live dig this one. This could be silver, folks. This could be silver. Come on, Silv. Come on. All right, it's right. Gonna be in the sidewall. I see the different colored. Nope, it's just gonna be a clad quarter, dog, on it. Man, I was hoping that's gonna be a silver quarter. All right, let's keep going. Maybe we'll get us a silver. Well, Hunter's calling me over. Says he's got a half, but it's not gonna be a silver half. But hey, ever since we found that gold ring, we've been it's been silent. But he did get. I've no, never dug a Kennedy half. And... Well, you got you a half dollar, man. That's something, isn't it? It is. 1990 what? 90, uh, 95. 95. Well, that's a big, big coin. <laughs> I've dug a lot of clad, but haven't dug any silver. It's crazy that that big of a coin hasn't been picked up. I know it's much as it's been hunted. It goes to show you there's still stuff out here. So maybe we'll get something here in a second. Let's keep at it. Well, this was a very weird tone. I was getting a good tone, but absolutely no number. There was no red line there to, to indicate that it was iron. And it was real kind of up and down the line a little bit, kind of fading off and back on. And uh, I thought, hey, dig this thing out anyway. I'm glad I did. Check this out. It's going to be a bracelet. I don't think it's going to be silver. It's got something on it right there. It could be silver. I don't see no markings, do you? It feels a little light to be silver. I think it's going to be aluminum. Oh, I thought it was going to be silver there for a second. Anyway, let's get it there and let's get a picture and let's keep on going. Y'all want to have a little fun with Hunter? I, uh, I brought a bunch of coins from the house. This is my first time to be out in two and a half months. It's, it's Hunter's first time as well. We came out to this football field just to kind of know that we get a lot of targets and kind of learn our numbers a little bit and get kind of reacquainted with our manacores. But uh, you can look, I got a handful of mercs and uh, I got some war nickels in there, some rosy dimes in there. I'm fixing to throw it all in the hole in there. I called him over here and uh, he hates it when I come over on his territory where he's detected and uh, I find stuff. So I want to tell him I found this huge coin spill. I don't think I'm even going to tell him until he watches the video. So Hunter, you're in for a big surprise here. Maybe he'll, you'll leave me a good comment at the end of this video. So let's call him over here and let's see his reaction. He's way down there on the other end. So let's not tell him. Let's just we go and unless he figures it out. Let's just go and not let not say anything until he gets here on the on the uh, on the video and he can watch it. So Hunter, I love playing tricks on you. So it's been a while, so I thought I'd play a trick on you on this video. Have a lot of fun with it. So here he comes. I thought I'd come over here in this area where you detected and see if I could find anything. Yeah, there's the plugs all around us. No, those are your plugs, man. <laughs> oh, come here and check this out. There are signals everywhere. It was kind of a real... I couldn't even get anything. It was just a weird tone, and it didn't sound like anything at all. And uh, I, I can see several coins. Stick your pinpoint in there. Are you serious? Yes. I mean, it didn't sound like uh, coins at all. I see uh, maybe a... Oh, oh, <laughs> look at that. Watch those ants, man. They're falling down the hole. Gosh, man. Have you dug out of that hole yet? No, I, I, I just saw it all fall in and fall out. It's like a, it sounded like a jumbled up signal. Dig them out. I'll film. You dig them out. Lay them right here on top of the, the man. Watch those ants, though. So that's what, one, is that a Merc? Yeah, I think I may need a minute to catch my breath. 
All right, there's a rosy. Is that a war? It looks like I it. bet it's a war nickel with a rosy. I mean, with a yep. merc. War nickel. Another, uh, another war nickel. 1917. You can see the circle around that thing. Now, what did this sound like? It was so many coins in there. It just sounded like a big old gobbled up, blah, 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 just a mess. At first, I didn't even have a signal. No, I mean, no number. Before we get to the exciting part, any more out in the top? We know there's two right there. I see, I see another one in there. Another 17 Merc. And that's some old ones. Yeah, that's a uh, Rosie. What is this one going to be? Is that another one? Yep, another Merc. Gosh, man. 40. I wonder nobody's found this because he wouldn't have dug it. It sounded like a bunch of iron and it didn't sound good at all. 45. So it's kind of a late spill with early dimes in it. I don't even care about this. Man. Let's see what we got. Let's see what else. There's another one. Gosh, you're still coming. I see it right here. Rosie, gosh, I see it. Yeah. No, I can't believe what I'm uh, right in the bottom. Another row, uh, Merc. So let's look up here. Is that a, your machine? We got over a dollar. There's more in there, I promise you. Let me readjust my... Nope. Maybe one more in there. The big old uh, spill. Let me see. I don't think, I think it's falsing. Wow, look at that, Hunter. Rosie, Merc, Merc, War Nickel, Merc, Merc, Rosie, Rosie, Merc, 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 War Nickel. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve silver spill. And you missed it. Congratulations. <laughs> and you missed it, dude. Yep. He went all through here. Um, I'm gonna search around here. Maybe there will be more out here. I'm curious. I wish I would have got this pound over with. How did you miss that, Hunter? That's what I want to know. We'd have to ask for how they missed this. Man, like I said, it didn't sound like a, a silver spill at all. It just sounded like a, you know, you get some high tone iron and junk and jumping around, and it wasn't a good signal at all. So, well, let's keep swinging in here. See what else we can find. Wow, that's incredible. Well, I just want to look on your face there. Um, hey, <laughs> it's yours. I wish I would have gotten a swing over this to see what it sounded oh, like. Oh, man. You got to be a pro to get this kind of stuff, young I was fixing, grasshopper. I was fixing to come over here and get all cocky because I picked up a few of your Wheaties over there that you missed. But, but this, I'll uh, leave those Wheaties for you. I, I think this, uh, this I'll take all the silver. I'll leave the Wheaties for you. Yeah. Did you get a Wheatie, though? How many Wheaties you get? I got three over in that little. Oh, so you're winning three to two. I got to get busy on the Wheaties. We're forgetting about the yeah. Wheaties at this point. Oh, yeah. Let's keep swinging. Let's see what else we can get. Say that again on camera. I said, if I didn't know you any better, I would have started having to check your pockets before we come out <laughs> to check them. You figured me hey. out. I'm just messing uh, with you, man. <laughs> let's see what we got here. I'm just messing with you. I, was, I wasn't going to say anything until the video and let you watch it. No. Nah, you don't have any. Oh, I'm messing with you. <laughs> I brought those today. We haven't oh, been you out. Did? Yeah. We haven't been out in a while. I to say a couple of those. And uh, I just thought I'd come out here and mess with you just a little bit and 
and we haven't been digging in a while. I needed a break anyway, so I thought I'd just get a break and tease you just a little oh, bit. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my oh, gosh. Yeah, that's a lot of fun to play with you, buddy. So let's keep swinging. Let's see what we can get. Well, I was getting a 29.30. It was right on the line. It was a good tight uh, dot as well. Usually, what, a 20? We've been digging niggles anywhere from 24 to 31. Most of them are going to come in around 28, 29. This one's coming in a 29 to a 30, a solid. And check this out. I think I may have a war nickel. If I do, let me call Hunter over here and we'll clean this up together. Well, he's already gone. So let's. Yep, it's going to be a war nickel. Finally, we got some silver on the board today. Let's see what year this might be. Train's coming through. Oh, 1940-something. It's going to be a 42 to 45, I believe. But we got silver today. Only 35%, but I'll take it. All right, let's set the beauty right there. Let's get a picture and let's see if there's any more in here. All right, guys. Look at that. So on the line, it's a tight signal. 83 to 97. It's showing to be about 8 inches down. So I'm going to live dig this. I'm going to hand this over to, to uh, Hunter. And maybe we won't jinx it. A silver quarter would be good right here, wouldn't it? It would be great. No, it's a ring. It's a ring. Look at that. Right there. Oh, it's a big one, too. A live dug a big ring. I saw the hoop of that thing before. Check that out. It's got diamonds in it, too. Woo! Wow. Look at that thing. Look at that. Woo! That is awesome. That is awesome. Woo. How in the world that fat boy got missed? I don't know, but I'm glad I live dug it. There you go. There's still stuff out here, isn't there? Mm-hmm. Still stuff out here. That's beautiful. Well, let's clean it up and let's uh, see what it's going to be. Ready. I don't have any holy water. Well, that's a big silver ring, though. Sterling or it's old. Wow. There it is right there. 925. Okay. So it's gonna be 1973 and earlier older. Yeah. Look at that thing. Are all the diamonds intact? I have a diamond tester, I'll test it later. That thing near about fit me. It will fit me. Check that out. Yeah. Wow. That'll fit me. Now, there we go, boys. I'm going to check those diamonds when I get home and see if they're going to be real. I doubt it. Being not, if it says sterling with diamonds, it could be because old settings were a diamond, some of them. But being 925, I doubt that. But they're just CZs. Well, that's a pretty ring, though. Let's keep swinging and see what else we can get. Well, it's getting kind of dark on us. <clears throat> we decided to get the field is right over here behind me, get you know, over the fence. It looks like an old house site back in here and a lot of clad. I'm not even digging the clad. I'm listening for wheat pennies because Hunter 
he's got me beat four to three and uh that's the last time i checked with him but i got a good target right here it looks like a token one of those good luck tokens check this out just popped it up about four inches deep it's gonna be pretty toasted i'm not even gonna try to clean that up but i think it's one of those uh tokens they put a penny in right here it's a horseshoe for good luck they used them a lot for uh, for uh elections they were little things that they passed out to get people to vote for for it for them i'll try to clean it up a little bit if i can find my acid that i put these things in i might clean that up pretty good and get it down to what we, what it says i'm gonna leave that here and just keep digging since i only got about an hour left of daylight all right let's get a picture and keep rolling Well, I dug my token right there and moved over here. Had a 89 signal. Popped it up and cleaned it off a little bit to see what it says. It's going to be a hubcap. I'm trying to see if I can clean it on my pants a little bit. Yeah, let me clean it up and see what that says. I've never dug one this small i've dug some ford ones of you know let me clean it up and see what this is going to be i don't know folks it says something usa it starts with a b i don't know made in usa but you can see it's like an old hubcap or something maybe it was screwed on i have to look that up maybe you'll i'll have it identified by the time you're watching this video right here all right let's keep swinging see what else we can get we're over here over this house site a lot of trash so i'm not really live digging getting a solid 95 straight on the conductive line tight about six inches deep and so i didn't live dig it because i thought it was trash but popped it up y'all check this out it's gonna be a copper bracelet armband so let me clean this up and uh, kind of see if I can straighten it out a little bit and I'll show it to you well here she is you see it's a uh, in those armband bracelets and a copper I can maybe straighten it up a little bit more when I get to the house but hey that's pretty something different it's turned out to be a pretty good day so I'll take anything I can get. Started out just a little bit slow, but uh, ended up being pretty nice. I would say that's 70s, because if I remember as a kid, a lot of, I remember adults wearing a lot of these things in the 70s. Uh, these big arm bracelets like that. A lot of them had turquoise on them, and stuff like that. So let's keep swinging. Let's go do a wrap up and uh, let's see what all Hunter found as well. Well, we had a good day out here at the old football field, and I'm glad that Hunter came along. We were going to go to another house in a vacant lot we had permission on, but at the last minute, we decided to come to this old field and just see what we can do, because we really wanted to learn our machines again, our, our, our mana cores. It's been since May since I've been on one, and I uh, only was on it for two months before then. Then it went, went to water digging, water hunting, and so... I wanted to kind of come where we dig a lot of targets and where we dug a lot of targets. I had a pretty good day. Hunter, not so much. Uh, he had a good joke put on him. He, he, found a lot of, he found a lot of coins. But I'll make up for that here in just a second. But anyway, let me spin you around. Let me show you what we found here today. Here's my trash. Hunter's trash is not in there, but I bet he dug just as much as I did. A lot of trash there. And uh, here are my finds. Ended up with eight pennies, four nickels seven dimes five quarters then hunter found this canadian penny and he found this uh jefferson i mean not jefferson but uh, kennedy half dollar so he found what year was that 1990 uh 95 1995 and 1953 canadian penny there it is go that way uh i ended up finding this is not a hubcap it says bright star hunter looked it up we believe it's the end of a flashlight is what that is bright star made in usa 
found that good luck token and uh, found a bracelet big copper bracelet pretty nice one and I found the uh, another bracelet I had a kind of a jewelry kind of day today uh, we were playing the weedy and so the final score hunter four preacher digger three and so the winner I said was going to get a mercury dime so there you go you won your mercury dime today hold that up it's the only silver you got today, but it's a silver, though, isn't it? It's the only way I could get one. Yeah. Awesome. So, Thank you. All right. But I've got two more silver dimes right here I want to give him, too, because what I would do is that throughout the day, I would call out, what is a 38? And if he got it right on the dot, I told him I'd give him a silver dime. And I think at 38, he called a pull tab. And he got it. I said, what is a 51? And he called that out and got it right. It was a, it was a, a clad penny. I was thinking zinking. So here or two more mercury dimes for you that's the least i can do after playing that joke on you yeah. <laughs> on that coin oh, spiel yeah. so you made a little silver out of the deal today About three silvers three silvers and i ended up getting one silver coin uh 43 war nickel thought i had another war nickel right there but that 43 i'll take that then i did get a gold ring i still haven't cleaned it up yet it's a tiny little gold ring I thought it's going to be plated, but it's not. It's going to be gold. And then I got that big, huge silver ring. It's a size 12 because that's the size of my finger. And so that's my finds for the day. Ended up being a lot of jewelry and not many coins at all. But before I wrap this up, I told you I was going to do a giveaway. And so since this is my first video back, I thought I'd kind of pull everybody back in. And so uh the rules are the same you're gonna have to watch the video of course like the video and the main thing i want you to do i want you to share the video i want you to put it on your instagram i want you to put it on your facebook wall i want you just to copy paste this however you will get it shared share it out to your friends and uh because that's going to be one of the requirements for you to win these things and leave me a comment leave me a comment about what you thought about the video having fun stuff like that and uh, it's just good to get back out with friends but anyway i got three prizes i want to give away and the first prize i'm going to give away is this uh fines pouch it can go in water or land it can zip tie up it's got pockets on the inside it's got pockets on the outside it's got a spot for your your uh your pin pointer to go right there that's going to be the first drawing uh, that I do this is about oh I forgot how much I paid for this but uh, it's a pretty nice little thing I was going to use it for my water detecting but I ended up just didn't do it so anyway it can be used for land or water so that's going to be drawing number one drawing number two you remember at the middle of my video I played that joke on Hunter and, and uh, threw out all those silver dimes so there's seven silver dimes and two war nickels here I'm going to give this away to to one of you and so uh, make sure you like the video make sure you comment make it sure you share uh, this is going to be for us uh, entries only uh, so uh, we're going to give that away for the second drawing and for the number one drawing we're going to give away this 19 check this out 34 piece dollar that's about a 45 dollar value right there and uh, 90 percent silver I wish I could dig another one of these. I've dug two of them in my lifetime. But so we're going to give that away. So again, I'll put the rules right here. Make sure you like the video, share the video, comment on this video. And uh, we'll be doing the drawing a week after this video airs. So a week after. I don't know the date. I'll put the date right here uh, for when that will be. I'm not sure right now as I'm filming this. But we'll be giving that away. So there it is. First drawing, second drawing, third drawing pretty nice prizes so there's all my trash and here's all our treasure and like I always say the greatest treasure my friends is not what you can find out in a football field and put on your tailgate and do a wrap-up the greatest treasure is what can be found up in heaven keep searching keep looking up until we meet again I just wish everybody happy hunting and God bless